Hey everybody. So as you know, my name is Kianti Ashe and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be a reading for our Earth signs. All right. So our Virgos, Taurians, and Capricorns. Let us go ahead, jump right into it. Let us see what the messages are. The Spirit has here for you on today. Please do keep in mind, you all, that these are general messages. Only take what resonates with you and leave the rest. All right. Let's go ahead and get right into it. Okay, we have no, it's not the right time. Coming out with yes, luck is on your side. Okay, so there's something you're thinking about when it comes to an air sign. The answer to that is no. But when it comes to something else, okay, it looks really good. It looks really promising. Okay, we have distance. Okay, it says you and your partner may be physically or emotionally distant. Okay, whomever it is that you want, whoever it is that things are going well with, that you have mutual energy here with, you and this person may be at a physical or an emotional distance due to whatever this situation was. Okay, so let us see. Okay, yeah, we have intimacy, all right? You're craving intimacy with your person, all right? They're craving intimacy with you. This is physical, emotional, okay? However it applies, mental, all right? So sexual chemistry, reminiscing. Somebody can't stop thinking about you, all right? In the event you and this person have been intimate, let me tell you something, they think about it quite often, okay? We have gambling. This person feels like they should have taken a chance and come toward you or... They'll do anything for you. You know, this person could have had something or you could have had something because it's two different energies here. Okay. But whatever this is, I feel like it's falling off. It's falling away. Whatever this is applies to this. Okay. So it's almost like you took your chances with something and you're going with or you're taking your chances with something and you're going with what you feel would work better for you. The relationship that works better for you. Something like that. Okay. Okay. What's the underlining here? We got love spell. <laughs> You've been bewitched, okay? So you feel like somebody has put you under a love spell, hunty. All right, you feel like somebody has put you under a love spell. With this gambling too, be very mindful of where you're spending your money, okay? Because I feel like just as fast as you get it, you could lose it with that yes and no, no and yes and all that stuff, okay? So just be mindful. Let us see. <clears throat> yep, okay. We have a Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Swords. I feel like somebody's thinking about you. You're thinking about them. We have the Empress, Divine Feminine Energy. All right. You're very alluring. Yeah. Well, fortune. Yeah, luck is on your side. All right. Keep doing whatever it is you're doing. Temperance, Divine Intervention, Divine Protection, Eight of Pentacles, Hard Work. Okay. Being very diligent. Queen of Cups in Reverse. I feel like when it comes to a water sign that maybe some of you were dealing with, okay, you're cutting that off. I also feel this energy here where, take the sex out of it. Um, some of you may have water sign placements, okay? And you may be very emotional at times or extremely sensitive. And at this time, it's, it's not like you're desensitizing yourself or as if you've been desensitized, but you are turning it down a lot, okay? You're turning it down a lot. You're getting out of your heart and into your head or something like that. You have high priestess. You're still trusting your intuition, all right? But you're getting out of your heart and into your head because maybe you're not staying to yourself as much. You're around people more, okay? So you want to protect your energy. You don't want to give your heart away to just everybody you meet, friends, associates, you know what I'm saying? You're protecting yourself, yeah. I just noticed that on the back of the high priestess's throne, doesn't it look like a heart, you guys? And it looks like it's upside down. Can you see that? Okay, right? Not tripping. So it's like you're putting a pause on that or something. Somebody may feel like you're being stubborn. Okay. Because this over here in the corner kind of looks like a bull, like a cow or something with the horns and the head looks turned. Okay. So four pinnacles in reverse. It's like you're releasing something and you're leaving it in the past. Somebody won't let something in or they refuse to let something in. This could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay. With the king of wands here in reverse. Again, take the six out of it. Two of cups in reverse. But there was a separation, a breakup. Okay. Five of cups. This is like a soulmate of yours or could have been a karmic to you. Okay. We got the seven of swords here in the sideways. You feel manipulated. You feel deceived. Okay, you feel let down in some way, all right? 
But like I said, there's a brand new beginning coming here. It's like you have options, okay? You have options, seven of cups, page of cups. And I feel like you're starting something else somewhere else. It's almost like you just let everything play itself out so that you can see which direction you were going to be going in. You know what I mean? Yeah, page of swords in reverse, you know? You let everything play itself out so you can see which direction you were going to be going in. We have six of swords in reverse, okay? And we have the three of swords in reverse. Wow. But the person that you really want because of whatever this was, like I said earlier, it's like now there's distance between you and this person. You feel like you may have cost yourself that because of whatever that other situation was. Okay? Yeah, the sun card. It makes you really happy. This person, this connection... <clears throat> mm. spirit doesn't want for you to stress about it because what's meant to be will be with the tower and the fool card i feel like there's going to be a way made okay there is a fire sign somewhere aries leo sagittarius okay that it's something you need to know something about this person you know there's something you need to know about this person okay let us see yeah, we have the five of cups, two of cups in reverse. Again, this could be the person from the past or the person that you feel like caused an interference with whatever you have going on. Yeah, seven of cups, somebody could have caused confusion, chaos, illusion. There could have been some trickery, some freakery done. All right, some spell work. We did see love spell. Ten of swords, all right? Somebody wanted to be uh, betray you, like stab you in the back. Somebody wanted to stop whatever it was that you were doing, okay? With the seven of wands in reverse, now you feel like defeated okay you feel like again you could have lost the person that you really want because of whatever this other situation is just for nothing you know yeah three of cups in reverse it's a third party and page of cups it's like reconciliation apologizing okay hmm then we have the sun card all right sun card is happiness joy again Let us see, we have the Fool card, okay, and we have the King of Coins. So, Fool card is a brand new beginning, taking a leap of faith, okay. The World card in reverse, okay, and the Chariot in reverse, yeah, okay. So, again, there's someone somewhere, there's an air sign involved here as well, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, all right. Somebody attempted to do some sort of work okay spell work with the ace of wands in reverse yet and still will of fortune in the upright you continue to move forward you continue to progress all continues to be well king of pentacles in the upright you're still sturdy you're still stable everything is good okay i feel like the person that you want is still making their way towards you everything's still working itself out with that so again luck is on your side whatever you want to happen will happen what is this four pentacles in reverse and this seven of swords spirit the strength card in reverse somebody was trying to force something to happen it's like you're with your twin you're making it work is is successful and you know there's this interference or it's almost like in the event that you were trying to stay away from your twin because of something else that something else doesn't work tower card spirit brings something to your awareness so that you know a way can be made for you to be with your twin or something like that Ciao. What is this Three of Cups in reverse in this Page of Cups spirit? Because that's third party energy when it's in reverse. Okay. Nine of Wands. I don't know. It's just like you might have to like beg for forgiveness or it's not that you want to okay or this is some this flip it how you need to but the way it's coming out is like earth sign this is you okay i'm just gonna read okay it may not be literal begging i would hope okay but it's more like <clears throat> you and somebody may not be speaking this may be something that could potentially be over meanwhile you truly do want them but this is because of whatever risk you took or whatever decision you made. And it was a temporary thing. It wasn't something that was supposed to be permanent. Okay. So we have the five of cups here. We have the two of cups in reverse. Three of pentacles in reverse. Yeah. Okay. It's like whatever this is from the past, you don't want it. And flip it. If this is your person, whatever it is from the past, they don't want it. They want you. 
Queen of Pentacles is in the upright. Nine of Pentacles here with the Ten of Cups and the Empress. Okay, they want you. They want to be with their divine feminine counterpart. That's what it's giving. Okay, or you want to be with your divine feminine counterpart. Put yourself wherever side you go and take the sex out of it. Okay, yeah, we have Emperor here. So the divine feminine and masculine want to be together. But there's an air sign somewhere in the way. Air sign, fire sign, because we did see fire sign earlier. Okay, so it's a couple of things that are in the way here. Okay, not just one, not just two, but it's, like it's several things that could have been delaying it or stopping it or holding it up, whatever you want to call it. You got the Queen of Cups in reverse, okay? Somebody may fear that you no longer love them, okay? Because they didn't come to you and make this offer in time. It's like, you know, they gambled their opportunity away. They lost it. They fumbled it, okay? But Spirit is going to make a way. Somebody could have been put under a love spell, <clears throat> okay we have playing games okay yeah some of you feel like that's what it is you feel like you gambled away your twin flame relationship for somebody that was playing games with you you get what i'm saying or somebody that's been playing mind games with you control games with you this entire time meanwhile it's somebody that you really truly love you really want to be with that now has like blocked you or you know has started dating other options and stuff and you're like, what the hell? You know, I did all that for this and this ain't even what I want or something like that. Yeah. Mm. I feel like if it's meant to be, it'll come back. If it's meant to be, it'll happen because this person feels like you're special to them. Okay. They might be low key, high key obsessed with you. Okay. Yeah. And even that, you know, <clears throat> somebody tried to put a love spell on you or try to intervene with your divine counterpart relationship it's out of jealousy okay yeah you need to let that person go or you've been telling them to let you go you don't want them you don't want that relationship you don't want that connection you want your twin flame counterpart okay that's who you want all right so i pray that this helps you i know that it will if this was your reading or you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up and if you have not already go ahead and subscribe peace and have